certainly has been a while. Right now, Central Park, 36 degrees. We have mostly clear skies, so it is a quiet night. A little bit of a westerly breeze right now, just about 10 to 15 miles per hour, and that breeze is going to be with us for the next few days. Now starting to see a difference. Past few weeks, we had all this warm air in place. Now the cold air is starting to build south from Canada. You can see it from Minneapolis to Chicago, Detroit, Syracuse, and even here in New York City where temps are in the 30s, and that's what it's going to look like for the next few days. Skies are mostly clear, few scattered clouds drifting on by, and we still have those persistent lake effect snow bands north and west, especially places like Buffalo. Already got about a foot of snow, and we're going to be adding to that tomorrow. So you can see the snow showers with a cold air pouring in. There's a cold front, a strong one that's moving through Michigan right now towards Lake Erie, Lake Ontario, and that front is going to be responsible to br for bringing us the cold blast that will get here on Monday. That's really when you're going to feel the chill in the air. So as we take you through the night tonight, no problems, just a couple of scattered clouds. We look good tomorrow morning with the cold dry air in place. Visibility will be excellent, really a beautiful but cold morning. Here comes that cold front. We'll get a couple of scattered clouds from it. That's it. And yes, the cold air as we head on into Monday. That's when the big change will arrive. But this is the good news. Even though it's going to be very cold, we'll be enjoying a lot of sunshine and nice dry weather. So overnight tonight, lows 22 to 30 to, uh, 33 degrees right near freezing for many of us. Tomorrow, one last day where we'll make it into the 40s. We have clear skies in the morning, more clouds around, and then temperatures will be falling pretty quickly as we head into Monday. 31 for the high right there. That's during the afternoon below freezing. Same thing for Tuesday. We're near 30 degrees and with the wind, it will feel colder than that. A pretty day though, pretty weather. We have more sunshine coming our way for Wednesday into Thursday. Then temps go back up, so it's just a short-lived little cold blast there. Our next chance of wet weather doesn't get here until Saturday. So all the winter, you know, jackets and gloves yep. and hats we got for Christmas, you can wear them. <laughs> all right. Next and couple double days. Layers. Samantha, yeah. thank you. You're welcome. Tina is here now with a check of what's coming up in sports. And Christina, as reported earlier in news, there are multiple stories out today that Tom Coughlin will step down as head coach of the Giants on Monday. How is he preparing his team to face the Eagles tomorrow? That's next in sports. It's after.